The Kaduna State Governor Nasser Erufa has dismissed rumors he was lobbying for appointment as Chief of Staff to the President-elect Bolamir Tinubu. Erufa, who addressed journalists shortly after laying the foundation for the construction of 550 housing units and Gombe Geographic Information System Goji Service Center, described the reports on different portfolios assigned to him in the incoming government as mere speculations. The governor said he was more interested in contributing to the development of the country than jostling for positions. There were insinuations that the governor, the Speaker of the House of Representatives, Femi Bajabia Mila, and Minister of Works of Health and Housing, Babatunde Fashola, had been penciled down by the president elect as the National Security Advisor, NSA. Chief of Staff and Secretary to the Government of the Federation, respectively. The spiritual head of the Cherubim and Seraphim Movement Church, Prophet Samuel Abidoye, has advised the incoming administration of President-elect Bola Tinimbu to hit the ground running with people-oriented programs and policies targeted at addressing the increasing level of poverty in Nigeria. The 95-year-old clergyman made the call while addressing journalists on the sideline of the 2023 Horeb Convention of the Church on Sunday. Samuel Abidoye, while speaking on the State of the Nation, called on the president-elect to create a conducive environment for businesses to thrive, saying that there's a good starting point to delivering his campaign promises to the people. Talk on development in the nation and the challenges before the incoming administration. Government, the government should create a conducive environment for business to thrill, for people to make ends meet. The clergyman also touched on the need for improved infrastructure with particular emphasis on effective rail transportation systems. Government should also revive the moribund infrastructure, make railway work to lessen the pressure on the road. It should give attention to road construction and rehabilitation to stem wanted loss of life. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.